Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode on the Hermit Sky server. Hope everybody's having a good day. I'm doing fantastic, guys. Today is episode 10, and I've got a great episode planned for you, as always. I feel a thousand times better today. I'm feeling so much better. I'm so happy to be back recording full-time. Woo! All right, hashtag question of the day for today is... You have to make a decision. You can either have a beacon in Minecraft permanently as an effect, but to keep that effect, you must eat raw potatoes for the rest of Minecraft. You can't cook them, you can't bake them, you can't do anything with them. Do you accept these terms? Yes or no down in the comment section below using hashtag question of the day. Just to re reiterate, you are allowed to have one permanent beacon effect as an like an enchantment or something. Not an enchantment, but just as an effect. And so like haste, regen, things like that. But you can only eat raw potatoes to do it. Do you accept these terms and keep your, your one beacon effect? And if so, what beacon effect do you use? Let me know. As always, if you guys enjoy this series, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. As always, um... Let's see if we can hit 300 likes today, guys. So this thing has been running for a while, and I'm actually kind of genuinely curious as to how much is in here. Because it doesn't say, and I would really like to know. Let's click on it for a while and see what happens. By the way, somebody said, why isn't Jevin using a drawer controller? I kind of forgot that they were in the game. <laughs> Not gonna lie to you. <laughs> it was just a little bit my fault, Dad. That's, that's my fault. Okay, is that all that's in there? I think so. So not bad. There was uh, quite a bit in there. Yeah. Can I put this one in here? Oh, is it? It must be full then. I don't know if these have like... I know these aren't the most efficient things for storage, but whatever. Let's go ahead and chuck all these in there. And I'll put these in here. We'll get those all smelted. Okay, so I want to start thinking about planning a new base, but before I do that, we got to think about AE, because AE is like basically the center for everything. And if we're going to do that, we should probably switch to controllers. So controllers in this pack are made with platinum plates. That's really easy to make, though. Okay, platinum plates, easy to make. These engineering processes, these are easy to make. Uh, what we don't have is we don't have sky stone. So how do we get sky stone? Sky stone is lava and sky stone dust in a barrel. So how do we get sky stone dust? Sky stone dust is a process of sieving and we get a 24% chance with diamond, 16% chance with iron, 8% chance, and then a 2% chance. So we should probably think about automating a dust sieve, but before we do that, we're going to need a lot of dust. Um, let's quickly grab a hammer. I should probably actually make another hammer too. I am out of sticks. Somebody got something. Oh. Uh, teleport to a new location. Cool, man. Congratulations, Wells. I'm proud of you, buddy. There we go. So we'll grab all of the sand, turn that into dust. There we go. And we've got this big grass field so we can do this in. So this shouldn't be too much of an issue. Let's go ahead and turn on our magnet. There we go. All right. So I know you guys are probably wondering, like, am I going to prank somebody today? See, here's the thing, right? I have pranked like probably 65% of the server. And the problem is nobody's pranking me back. And the people that I want to prank are online right now. <laughs> so until I can find a moment of clarity where not everybody is on the server at once, I can't really do anything. So I'm going to have to be creative at the times that I play to prank somebody. Because I did have a prank plan for this episode, but I can't because the person that I want to prank is online. So do I have an extra mechanical user? I don't know if I do or not. I pretty much have none of that. Okay, cool. Good talk, guys. Good talk. There we go. Put that away. Um, what I think I'm gonna do is I think I'm just gonna casually. Hold on. Let me put that, 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 that. I'm just gonna probably switch these out actually. 
there. Yeah, we'll just uh, we'll just replace all of this. That will start making a skystone dust, and I probably should make a drawer controller. Now that I think about it, I think I'm actually going to make a little bit more, probably enough to fill this one up as well. So we've already got four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. How? Oh, by the way, how are we doing on silicone and flint? Silicone. We probably have a ton of flint. Okay. So let's break a little bit more so we can fill the rest of that in. Um, okay, there we go. By the way, thank you guys all for all of your recommendations for the mod stuff for beta. I was able to get industrial craft installed and I'm still working on some of the other mods, but it's getting there. It's getting there. So we might have a modded season for beta soon. We'll see. All right. So go ahead and switch all these over. You, you. There we go. Oops. Come on. There and there. All right, so we have plenty of dust sieving now. So we should start to see skystone dust. You know what? You know what's weird? I'm getting less frame rate today. I don't know. I just feel like my frame rate is super limited right now. Hold on this. What am I getting for frames? 57, 60. It's got to be this, right? If I look the other way. I don't know. It's weird. I'm just getting less frame rate. Reaser. Okay. Server starting in five minutes. Okay. So controller. What do we need for the drawer controller? That's all pretty straightforward. Let me make sure I don't have one of those. I kind of feel like I made one. No. Okay. So we just need to make these then. Two of those. Drawer controller. And that's going to save us all of the mishap of doing all of these cables and I need to be able to get back there. So we'll just simply remove this half slab. Why am I lagging so much? There's I'm going to have to like restart my computer or something. I think. There we go. So let's remove all of this. There's there's got to be something going on because my FPS is tanking. So we can put the controller right here and we'll set to insert. So the priority to 10 and then we'll simply just run the cable down the back here. And what I'll do is I'll just uh, disable the rest of it. So, so we'll just go disabled, but there is something wrong with my computer. My computer has been dying. Luckily, I've been saving for a new computer. So I should be able to get a new computer by the end of December, I think. So it's going to be a monster. There we go. So uh, that should take care of the controller issues. Why is this one not running? Always on. I'm confused. I'm going to switch. Oh, it's probably the mesh. Let me switch to diamond here. If I'm not mistaken, though, if I use diamond mesh on both of them, it'll I they have like this weird quality where they run together. Watch. Maybe not. Why is that not working? See, and I don't think it took anything out of here. I think it took it out of here. It's so weird. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to let that go. I'll be back. Okay, guys. So I can't figure out where my frame rate issues are coming from. It's driving me crazy, though. So I want to go ahead and start working on a new base. I think we're going to build off of this. We'll probably just come off of here. I guess it doesn't really matter too far. Probably. Uh, that'll work. Yeah. Um... Okay, get rid of you. Actually, let me... I'm going to need to turn my magnet back on so I don't lose a bunch of stuff. There we go. Okay, so this is going to be our, our platform. Now, I have this idea. Do I have... Let me grab a builder's wand really quickly. Um, okay. 
wand. There we go. So I want my my new base to be all outdoorsy. Not like have any doors. So I can just fly to any like any section that I need to. Uh essentially. So there's five by five. I really like this platform block that I chose. It's like a embossed one. So let's see. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Six, seven, eight. 10 okay so let's think about this if we're going to make a main platform the thing we're going to want to use the most is applied energistics so if we're going to use applied energistics then um oh i forgot about that crap we're going to need we'll probably do our normal setup which is uh nine of each probably so that means that we would probably want to have an e an odd number rather than an even number. So there's 10. Um, what would we want to use? 3, 6, 9, 12. I think 12 is going to be sort of our number for this. So something like that. Then I um, kind of want to decide on height how tall we want to be. Um, do I want to do square or do I want to do some kind of weird shape? We could do some kind of weird shape where we kind of break off the corners or something like that. I don't want to, I don't really want to do a circle though. I always do circles and that's not something that I want to do this time. So there guys, yeah, so cold in my apartment. Have my sweatshirt on. That's a that's like a sign or something, man. I don't. I refuse to turn on the heat though. So maybe something like that. I kind of like that actually. It's still pretty square, but at the same time, gives it kind of a cool little flavor. Put the flavor in your ear. There we go. I really like that. Okay, fantastic. So that's gonna be our main platform. This is where we're gonna do all of our AE stuff. This is going to have the controllers. So let's think. I'm probably going to have the controllers right here. Is that where I want to put them? That's kind of small, though. There. And then we'll probably do... I want to do four tall. So one, two, three, four. And there. Because I want to give us plenty of room... So four tall is going to be, let's go ahead and build the platform for four tall. Something like that, I think. And for those of you wondering, uh, I had mentioned I'm getting a new PC soon. Um, my new PC specs are pretty baller. <laughs> it's going to be a pretty good PC. It's, yeah. You know, I'm, uh, I'm finally buying a PC that I like actually want to buy not something that i just need to buy to have a computer there we go something like that yeah all right let's quickly fill that in there we go so i do like that height i do like the size and we won't need pillars for this because we're going to have applied energistics How are we going to do lighting? We could do glowstone or like glowstone nooks or something like that. I still kind of want to put some stuff in. Um, I kind of want to use a different block, though. Let's go grab our chisel really quickly. Uh, chisel. And let's see. Is there any other blocks that I might want to use? Let me turn my magnet off while I'm over here. I kind of want to use something different this time. So we have like that really clean flush look. Maybe like these big panels could be something cool that we use. How do those look? It's all pretty gray though. You know what I mean? How does that? 
I don't think that block really fits that scheme. I do like this block, though. Uh, I want to use a different color. I was going to say, please don't vein mine the platform. The only problem is, is that I don't think... Like, marble or something? Marble? No. I don't really have any other items I could use. I could use possibly use oak wood. That could be a thing. Because uh, the logs, logs don't have it. Okay, let's go ahead and chisel that. Do I like any of these? If I were to use them, I don't know. Maybe that one. Split these up. 16, maybe this one. Let's try those two for now. I'm probably going to play around with a bunch of different things, though. Let's try this one. Uh, that doesn't fit that very well at all, to be honest with you. I always have the hardest time deciding on what, like, blocks to use. Those don't connect either. Nope. Okay. So we're going to have to figure something else out. You know what I might do? Hold on. One thing I haven't really considered. I've been running that thing for a while. Let's uh, chisel the obsidian. It's all very purple. And very, very hard to see. Can't really see it. Wow, those are super, super hard to see. Hold on, let's go upstairs. I'm trying to look at it by the inventory. Uh, organic chunk, shiny, map, map. I need something that has a... Oh, God. No, Obsidian's not going to work either. <laughs> All right, guys, let's take a little bit of a break from designing our base. I want to set up automation for Skystone. Now, I did make some. We have, like, ten. I want to make more, I think. Let's make all that we have. I also noticed something. Check this out. Watch. Watch over here. Watch where I'm standing. When this sieves, there's, like, a 50% chance this is going to go flying into the void. So it didn't happen that time. It's going to happen, though. Did it already go through all of that? Oh, it didn't. Okay. It's just randomly picking one. See it? We're throwing stuff into the void. Even though the hopper is right there, the hopper is not picking it up for some reason. Anyways, we're going to have to, fi we're gonna have to figure that issue out. Because I don't want to lose any items as it is. And it could cause the server lag. So... Uh, anyways, I want to set up automation for Skystone, so let's go ahead and do that first. Let me grab some blocks real fast. Party in there. Uh, guys, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you, right? I have Miley Cyrus stuck in my head right now. Party in the USA? It's my jam, dude. There we go. So, let's see. If, I probably want to have this just run into this hopper. So, we should have the output right here which means we need to have the the ender set up right here so put you there let me go grab a crucible if i have one might need to make one crucible there we go okay put that right there and then just need to have the cobblestone generator that's gonna bug me so much we have got to fix that didn't even notice it was doing that. Extract. Insert. So it's going to make lava. Then put that there. Extract. Insert. There we go. So that's going to start filling that chest, that tank up. It's actually really slow for some reason. Why is that so slow? It's never that slow. Something is different. Weird. Yeah, hey, I've never seen it go that slow before. Interesting. Anyways, we're just going to use a hopper. Because we don't really have a lot of Skystone dust yet. Put that in there. So then, to so just make this super easy on ourselves. 
Like that. And then let me grab some item conduit. Item condu her. There we go. Item conduit. Oh, good thing we only got four left, too. There. 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 Extract. So then we should be good to go. I should be going into the system. Sky stone. Perfect. Why do I have 4,000 ore pieces in here? Oh, you know what? I bet the controllers are full. That could be a problem. Isn't there controller upgrades? Like a frame upgrade or something like that. Um, at storage. These right here. Actually, I don't know if you can put those. Hold on. At storage. Can I? I don't know if I can put these on there. Increases the two times the base value. Eight times. Reduces the single base, single stack. Some of these are probably void. Well, I would probably want the ender one. Well, the ender, either, this one. Make like four of those. I'm out of sticks. Solid. I hope I can put these on there. Pretty sure I can. I'll have to make them for all of them. Apparently it's on there now. Yeah. All right, we definitely, definitely need to make more of those then. Uh, storage. So we need... What are we missing? So we... Okay, so... Hold on, let's go in here. Make some chests. Storage. Drawer. So there's some upgrades. I need to stop typing in there and stop typing up here. There, there, there. Sticks are going to be the death of me, man. There we go. So there's a bunch of them. <laughs> oh my god. There we go. There's two. There we go. So that'll take care of that, so that shouldn't put us, uh... Oh, you can stack them? Really? So, question. If I break this... Oh, it gave me all of them back. Okay. I see. Learn something new every day. Interesting. Well, I want to make sure that they all at least have one. Put that one on there. Huh, I did not know that. Alright, so that means that I should be able to take all of this out of here now. So many pieces. Yeah, that's what happens when it overfull overfills. I need to start smelting this stuff too, though. There's probably a thousand iron in there. Hold on. Now we've got to think of a way to fix that. That item shooting into the void. I could put another absorption hopper over there. There we go. So, if I were to put it there, I would just need to put it like right here, pretty much. Like right next to it, like right, right in the spot. So, do I have any more item conduit? No. So I'm missing this. That might be enough. There we go. Recipe. And then I need another hopper. I can't believe that's shooting into the void like that. Making me craft everything today. 
Got in the there we go. And then I need a chest. So, that right there. That right there. No more will we lose stuff. And then down. Let's just watch it for a second. Yeah, we just gotta make sure it goes in there. There we go. We're good. So then we just need to run that cable to the other other fluid duct. So we'll disable that. You. 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 There we go. I still think it might be going in there. But I can't really disable that part. I might have to... Um, run it over this way or something. There we go. So then, extract. Did that still fall into the void? No. No way, dude. I think it got it that time. All right. I think that's probably going to take care of this episode, guys. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. Otherwise, I hope you guys all have a great day. This is iJevin. Peace out.